filming right now. Am I gonna film right now? Mm -hmm. No. Alta. All right. <laughs> Toll hands before we cross the road. I'd hate to get hit. I mean you too. my channel so today's video I am very excited about this one I have already done it for the most part but I'm very excited to still share with you guys like this whole kind of journey and I am lucky enough to disclose and share with you guys because you know we like to keep it transparent here that this video is sponsored by Ana Luisa Jewelry this is the second video I've done in partnership with them I love Ana Luisa Jewelry they are just responsible sustainable and adorable there's a reason why we work so well together. If you guys haven't heard of Annalisa Jewelry, I promise you, you have seen them because they're basically the only jewelry that I wear. For example, I am wearing the Alexity necklace right now, which is a layered necklace. I actually love this piece. And the reason I love it is because it is a two piece set that comes with the mama and the daughter, like literally, that I could either share with my daughter or wear both. I actually like to wear both because I like the idea of like having us together. I don't know. No. That's my baby. But I love this necklace set. Honestly, like all of their jewelry, I haven't seen one piece on that side that I haven't liked. They are a very minimalist jewelry brand, not only in their design, because their designs are so sleek and modern and gorgeous, but they're also super affordable. Like, I mean, they really cut down the cost of luxury jewelry and really redefine what luxury jewelry should be costing. There is something for everybody and every single budget. A lot of their pieces start at $35, guys. I'm telling you, like, you're sleeping on them. They are a brand, again, known for their sustainability. They are very transparent. They believe in providing great quality for their customers when it comes to jewelry without sacrificing quality. Again, they make jewelry that is gorgeous and that doesn't come at the Earth's expense, which we love that because we love Mother Earth. I also feel super lucky to be a part of their Mother's Day campaign. This is my seventh year being a mom, which is one of my my favorite jobs in the world and this is my 27th year being a daughter so word they are currently at the moment having a 50% off sale up until May 10th so get on it I bought my mom a couple of pieces and I'm really excited to be able to share them with her I also got a couple pieces of my own I have this ring which I love love I'm obsessed with this ring this is their Michelle Singet. I also got my nails done, so you guys can't clock me on that as well. Not today. If you guys are interested in shopping this site, I'm gonna leave a link in my description box so you guys can go ahead and check it out. This brand that is so very lovingly helping me keep my lights on, supporting me, and supporting the earth, which supports us. It's a circle. Now let's talk about this makeup. I know it's not the best, but I really don't wanna hear too much about it because my daughter, if you guys read the title, which I'm sure you did, my seven-year-old picked out my makeup my boyfriend took her on a trip to Ulta but I gave my boyfriend really strict instructions to just let her do her thing all he had to do was manage her and not let her get lost or taken by strangers and I didn't want to be any part of it because I wanted to be surprised and boy was I everything that I'm wearing on my face right now my seven-year-old chose which honestly isn't bad if you guys are interested to see everything that she chose out please go ahead and just keep watching this video it's a fun one guys handsy sandy handsy sandy we need a full face makeup oh she already knows i think we have to find her skin tone you know what skin tone is same skin makeup yeah you got to match the color of mommy's skin i need a picture of her you don't remember what she looks like Yes, but I don't know what her skin looks like. Well, then you don't remember and I don't believe you. I think this is... That's the one? Yeah, she's very, yeah, very bright, super brown. Ultra deep, grab this one then. Why does it say naked? Because that's how I like to see her mother. Oh, you just know where everything is. Oh, we're doing lipstick. Holy water. We got holy water red. <laughs> Gel eyeliner. What is it? Sassy. Hey, it's sassy. We'll sass it in the basket. Let's get concealer. What's this concealer? These right here. We gotta do the same thing. We gotta get mommy's skin tone. So yeah, match it to the, the super dark one. Hey, this one match. Yeah. I mean, you're not wrong. Boop. <gasps> what about blush? Which one's this? BLF. Primer infused blush. You know what that is? What? I have no idea. I was asking you. Oh, what are these stuffs? No nail polish? No. Oh, you're really thinking about it. Which one is it going to be? Mm -hmm. Lash and brow serum. 
We need to get a pallet. You know what a pallet is? They look like, <gasps> like these. Oh, yes. Yes, queen. What is that? Yes. The yas queen? Highlight, what is that? I don't know. Get it, I don't know. Herb serum? Yeah, sure. Foundations, we have so much foundation. What has happened here? Let me get you with the backdrop. Smile. <laughs> okay, Sears <laughs> photo. Those are lip liners. What color do you like? What do you think mommy will like? Mm. This color? What is that one? Oh, Black. you know her so well. Which one is that? Oh, two colors? Broken. Okay. Okay, we need a finishing powder. What shade do you like with, with these? Yeah, get mommy's shade, which we all know it. Oh, that's more like Beebs' shade. I know her so well. Yeah, you do. Babe, you've never looked more mahogany. You'll get it. Fair. Foundations. The more the merrier is what I say. Yep, that's the one. Now you're, now you're getting it. Wait for it. Drop it. Nailed it. Boop. I don't need what? I don't. Just, okay. Fan, you want any free sanitizer? Okay. Yeah. Did we get a lip liner? White. Oh, that'll, that'll go good with her extremely dark, dark, dark skin. Okay. You want to get our perfume? So all of these right here. That is a perfume, I think. What's oh, a face mist? <sighs> Grab one. Yeah, just get right up in it. Don't even touch the bottles. COVID. Sniff that shoe. You like it? I'm saying this one. Be gentle with it. You want that one? Yeah. Okay, we got to get the actual box. So That's called Good Girl. Girl. It's a good show. Yeah. All right, last minute shopping. Anything else you think mommy would like for makeup? That one's cool. I like that one. Oh, it's Ariana Grande. Yeah. We can get that one. And then... That's all. That's it. All right. Because I love you, babe. I see sanitizer. You got sanitizer in the basket. <laughs> Good job. Don't get hit by the door. We secured the bag. Yeah, you can hold it. It's heavy. How was that? Was that fun? Yes. Me too. Yeah, I'll carry it. You got a lot of foundations. Oh, yeah. Where did you go? She didn't get everything, but she got... A lot of stuff. It's a good foundation. That'll be funny to you later. Okay. We bought you $900 worth of makeup. Are you for real? She went on a spree. <laughs> Beebs is going to have a talk with his personal accountant dance. Thanks, babe. Eh? You're welcome, back. Thank you, ma. She did it, not me. I'm not going to pick up, promise. Mm. I love you, boy. I keep laughing because I'm nervous. And I laugh when I'm nervous. I also laugh when I'm happy. So this is the bag. I haven't looked in here. I want to make that very clear. I'm nervous. I don't even know if I got like a full face of stuff. This is a perfume. Why? Why perfume? By Carolina Herrera. Ariana Grande Cloud. Out of all of her scents, this is my least favorite. We're getting somewhere. So we got the Kat Von D shade and liked contour palette. I think this is enough for a full face. Why is this foundation in the shade deep? Ma'am, I don't quite know like what the point of this is. Because I love you, babe. Um, so we did get a primer. Is this also a perfume? We also got a moisturizer though, so we cannot not moisturize with what your seven-year-old daughter chose for you. Skin Transforming Weightless Moisturizer Lotion. Oh, oh, that feels incredible. Oh, I love that. This doesn't go there. Now we can go into our Lancome Visionnaire Serum. Just because I'm curious to try it. Should the serum have gone before the moisturizer? Probably. And that smells like my grandma, which I'm not very fond of. My grandma, not the smell. <laughs> Anyways, so we're not technically really priming our face. We are seraming it. And let's just hope and pray that's enough to be primed with. I don't know if my daughter's trying to tell me something. Am I dry? Like I know my humor, you know. By the way, this is some packaging. I feel like I can really work out with this guy. I mean, I'm not going to, but it feels very luxury. So I think I have two foundations. Although, however, I'm, I'm actually gonna try and go into maybe eyes. I do need to do my brows. So I'm probably gonna go in with the ColourPop Brow Boss. She got mine in the shade Taupe, which isn't bad. Is it great? No, but it could have been worse. I do be feeling like a dewy tacky daisy. I'll tell you that much. 
Yeah, so the taupe life definitely isn't the life for me. I also went ahead and took the Libertad to look for the concealer to clean up these brows. Uh, this is the concealer that my daughter chose out for me. It's the ColourPop Pretty Fresh Concealer, which we love ColourPop and we love this concealer, I'm sure. It's just in this shade. Which I'm afraid if I put it on would be darker than my brows and there's just no need to, you know, go there. This is the Vanish Stick from Hourglass. Again, another crowd favorite here on YouTube. Again, she already done made her rounds. She already has been around the block. However, she is in the shade Vanilla, but I think still even this would be a better alternative. Vanilla actually looks more medium. Nah, she's definitely vanilla. Also, please don't mind my burn, guys. She was crimping her hair and she caught a piece of her scalp. It's fine though. I'm just gonna go ahead and move on to eyes. Eyes is kind of hard to mess up on. I feel like I kind of need a break before we move on to the face. So I'm gonna go ahead and just do one of these, do a quick little one of these numbers. This is the BH Cosmetics Hanging in Hawaii 16 color shadow palette. We're probably just gonna fast forward and make a cute little montage about it because it's just a whole look we're doing. Okay, so this palette is stunning. Literally could have gone and been more ham with it. Pero like, it's cute. Did we get eyeliner? I highly doubt she got me eyeliner. For foundation, again, she got me like three. So the Honest Thoughts Beverly Hills Luminous Foundation, <laughs> thank God. I actually love this foundation. And she got me this shade 230 Natural. I have this foundation. Let me check the data real quick. Okay, so the shade that I usually wear, 310C. Now, she got me 230N. Nailed it on the neutral part. Otoño, your mama is flat like paper, but neutral like Sweden. We can always just see what it looks like. I mean, it doesn't look like it would be too far off. You guys it really doesn't i mean the match isn't too far off which is gucci mane and keisha it's definitely not the best match because it's not necessarily like as dark as i am but we're gonna have to make it work guys because that's my baby i really do love this foundation is that cilantro in my teeth like this whole time sorry about that now however moving forward I'm gonna go ahead and try and contour at least with this shade, guys. It's deep dark, it's not even dark. This is very dark. I'm gonna use the liter like the literal tiniest amount of this because again, I, I, I wanna do my baby right, you know what I'm saying? I really do. She went out of her way to do this right after a very long day of the first grade. I'm gonna grab a little bit, a smidge, and we are going to cream bronze, which I think would only benefit us at this point, guys, because like I said, this foundation shade isn't horrible but it also could be a little bit darker which if anything this bronzing is gonna help us with okay so check it this actually isn't that bad she definitely looks like she's been getting that vitamin d the one with the rays okay no sanco chinas and i think it's because this concealer shade has a really pretty like orangey really warm goldeny undertone so honestly i just look very bronze la casita which is fine by me yo i am going to go ahead and conceal using our vanish stick because it's in a lighter shade if anything she got me a mediumish shade a shade that was too light and a shade that was a little too dark so honestly the mix wasn't that bad it's all about the balance grab my vanish stick apply a little bit of this because i don't need a lot of this because if there's one thing that is very well heard and known about miss vanish stick over here she is a full coverage mamma jamma let us blend honestly guys this isn't that bad out of everybody who i have asked to please choose my makeup my seven-year-old daughter who is into pokemon deadpool and sometimes the moon has done better do you guys do you guys see how that powder the shade that I'm actually really needing is the one that is broken. Of course. Of course. Isn't that how it always works out? I'm gonna try and be very careful and grab Lyric, which is the middle banana shade. And I'm just gonna set my under eyes with this and everywhere I applied that concealer. Now, like I've said, this has actually already made its rounds here on the YouTube. It's actually a pretty OG product. This, along with like Benefit Professional and Hula Bronzer, they are just some of those throw it back, throw it back, throw it back type of products. So we have another KVD powder. So this is gonna be a no. Hold your Camila Caballos though, cause we got one more. This is also gonna be a no. <coughs> I think we're gonna pass on that. 
blush. So this is the primer infused blush in the shade Always Cheeky. I love blush colors like this. I don't know if she knows that. I don't even know if she knows what blush is, but she knows how many Eevee evolutions there are. And again, it's all about the balance. That's real pretty. That's real pretty. Love this. Um, I am gonna go ahead and move on to mascara, or what I thought it was. But this is actually just transparent lash serum from CoverGirl. I mean, it might do something. Who even knows? And I actually do need a brow gel, so if anything, this will be a good brow gel. Oh, she gets me. She actually did give me a mascara. I am so happy to see you. This is the Essence Lash Princess Sculpted Volume Mascara. This is actually one of my favorite mascara brands in the drugstore. And it's mascara, period. So I'm just over the moon. We got a glitter holic glitter that I really do want to use from LA Girl. I'm honestly just gonna pop this on my cheekbones, guys. We don't have a highlight. At least I don't see. What, yeah, we definitely don't have a highlight, but we got glitter. And that honestly is good enough for me. I'll pop some on the center of my eyelids. I don't even care. That's really pretty. That's in the shade Hollow Glam, by the way. We have a couple of Gatita Von D EXO Vinyl Lipsticks. Both of these are in the shade Dahlia. We also have a Revlon Color Stay and Lancome Eyeliner or something. Lip liner, a clear lip liner. Is that a thing? Since when? Oh, I love this. I'm actually gonna go ahead and use the Revlon lipstick because Dahlia be looking dark, guys, and the look that we went for, it just wouldn't go. And one thing about being a mom is you gotta be consistent. We're gonna use Fashionista, and it's gonna be great. And here we are. I went ahead and took my hair down, put a little clip in. I did put some lip gloss on though, guys, but I didn't want to cheat too much because I'm going to tell you right now, this Revlon color stay, whatever, driest thing ever on the lips. I did use a clear lip gloss from Essence just because, again, I didn't want to cheat. I did want at least the color from what she chose, but this is the look. I'm not mad at it, guys. I'm really not. I think my daughter did a pretty incredible job. I want to thank my boyfriend for helping this process. And last but not least, I again want to give a huge shout out to my sponsor sponsor for this video, which is Annalisa. Thank you for partnering with me. Please make sure to check out the website. Again, I will have them linked down below. I want to wish all the moms out there a very happy Mother's Day or a very amazing Feliz Dia de las Madres. Other than that, I don't think I have anything else to say. And I just want you to remember, especially today, more than anything, baby girl, it's crazy what you deserve. Hi, thank you, Annalisa. Isn't there? Oh. <laughs> Hola, qué bonito. Está bonita.